So we're going to start. Um, James talked about how. Oh, I forgot about this. Now you can hear me better. Uh, James talked about how uh, this can be complex. What we're going to start with is breaking this down into kind of four basic steps uh, to make it a little bit easier uh, to digest. So the first thing and the most important thing for you guys uh, with digital marketing is you have to be found. Your business has to be found by your consumers. So as people are searching Google, searching on the web, you have to come up in directories and social media and search. Super, super important. Then once I find you, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to read your content. Whether I'm on your website, your social media space, whether I'm on a directory, I'm going to be looking at your content. So you have to have good quality content, but you also have to have consistent content. So the content that you put in social media and you put on your website that you may put in a directory or a blog has to be very um, consistent because that's how Google identifies who you are. That's how Google knows you're a personal injury attorney and not a criminal attorney. So if you do multiple things, you have to really think through how you're going to uh, articulate that out on, uh, on the web. Once that content is, is developed and really, really good the way that you want it, you want to distribute it. You want to get it out there so people can find it on, on Facebook, in, in YouTube, uh, in email. Really important to distribute your content. And then lastly, you've got all this great content. You want to drive people into it. You want to drive qualified traffic into uh, your website, to your blog, right? Uh, and that's advertising. And I think most of you in this room are pretty comfortable with advertising. We'll talk a little bit uh, more in detail what that looks like uh, on the web. So be found. That's where we're starting here. We have uh, this big screen behind me that looks all crazy. This is uh, the directory landscape, the social landscape, and the search landscape. Uh, they're all interwoven, and it's important that you're in many of these areas. Now, directories are examples like YP, City Search. Uh, you want to be here. There's 300 of them. Do you have to be in all 300? You don't, uh, but you need to, to pick significant amount of them and be really, really consistent with them. You want to make sure you're in social media, so Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Foursquare, same thing, consistent and good content. And then lastly, search, right? The end result of doing all this is that you want to come up and search. And the most important place in search is it starts with Google+. So we've talked about that. Uh, we don't know if it's going to be around uh, in next year, right? But today, it's the most important place uh, for small businesses to start with um, making sure they're found. So you want to have a Google Plus page, and you want that to be where you decide, this is what my name's going to be, this is my address, this is my phone number. If you have multiple locations, you need to have two Google Plus pages. You can't jam it all in, into one, one page. So your description, this is where you start with who am I online, and then you start matching it to the other directories, to YP, you match it to social media, you match it to Yahoo's local pages. City search, all of those, um, all of those different areas you match to Google Plus, and what you get out of that is you get to come up on the first page of Google, right? And this is uh, Anderson and Shapiro behind me, and this is uh, the angels singing down from heaven. They own the first page of Google for I Care Friendship Wisconsin. This is what everybody's trying to achieve, and you'll notice that not all of these uh, listings that are pulling up are their website. You see uh, MapQuest up here, I think you see YP here, you see their website. Um, so it doesn't matter to you, just as long as it's your business and, and people can get a hold of you from it. You want to come up on the first page. You also notice in the corner here that they're doing some advertising. So that's Google AdWords. And Google AdWords is another um, really important aspect in terms of coming up to the first page of Google. Not only does the ad appear, so you buy yourself there, but you're also helping to teach Google that you're a relevant result. So every time someone clicks on your, your Google ad, it tells them, yes, I am the uh, search result for I Care Friendship Wisconsin, right? And that starts to help, to help Google bring your, your organic search <coughs> towards the top. So um, in this particular case, Anderson Shapiro, right now with the AdWords, owns 46% of the available, available impressions when searching for, for that term. So, so it's pretty successful for them. We talked about being found and how important content is. So Troy's going to walk you through um, content here and what, what that means. 